What up, guys? It's Ryan from Phone Wagon. Here we are, day 31. Day 31. Um, quick morning update what I want to go over with you guys today. Something I've been thinking a lot about and that I'm completely guilty of. And I just went down this path and I don't like it, but I'm glad that I came out of it really, really quickly before something drastic happened. So, what I'm talking about is focus. Okay, so. I recently thought that I was going to just spread myself incredibly thin and do things that I know no that I know nothing about and I was going to try to dabble in them. And what I'm talking about is uh, real estate flips. Thought that was a good idea. For some reason, I think that or I thought that I should go down this path of something that I've never touched. I don't know anything about and I should spend my time there while building phone wagon, which is something that I feel like I know a lot about and I know the exact uh, path and the exact things that need to be done in order to get this thing to be a, a really big sustainable company. And honestly, I feel like the universe works in my favor because I went down and I, I did the inspection. I looked at the house and literally everything that could be wrong with the house was wrong with it. Okay, It had asbestos. There was termites. The house was literally sitting on the ground, so it would have had to have been jacked up. It was like everything was that could be wrong with it was wrong with it. I don't know a lot about real estate, but every multiple people told me. Multiple people, by the way, that were incentivized to tell me to buy it because they get a commission and they get paid for doing these things, the contractors, the real estate agent, and everything. They were all telling me not to touch it because it was that bad. So when that happened, and by the way, also my best friend told me, why are you going down? Why are you doing this? Like you have a good thing going. Um, point is, do not – you know, stray from the thing that you're you're doing, your focus, especially if that is something that you are highly competent in. You know exactly what you need to do in order to get there. Like, why steer off the path? So, what I decided recently and yesterday, I mean, I'm going fucking all in. Okay, I'm going all in, putting all the chips on the table, and I'm going all in on phone wagon right now. And I'm not getting distracted. I'm done doing trips. I'm done dabbling in other things. I'm taking any. Uh, anything that I would want to do and I'm saying no and I've heard a lot you know things on the internet it's like you got to be able to say no you got to be able to say no I'm saying no I'm saying no to everything if my friends want to hang out fuck you I'm not hanging out I'm, uh, I'm doing phone wagon so that's the thing that I think a lot of people pr- I mean I don't know about a lot of people but at least me you know you struggle with because you get excited about certain things I get excited about a lot of things you know I'm like a pretty like enthusiastic person whereas like you know, if something's interesting, I'll want to go down that path or I want to solve a problem or I want to, you know, uh, just bounce ideas off of people and see if we can figure things out. But there's tons of things like that within a, an organization or within a company, you know, for instance, like within phone wagons, particularly, you know, you can solve like, all right, how do we, you know, create a video series? How do we create content every single day? How do we create beautiful designs inside the product? How do we create beautiful, sophisticated sales funnels with retargeting and, and different segmentations and things like that? How do we create a sales team? Like there's, there's problems to be solved all under the umbrella that lead to, um, the same cause versus you know spreading yourself completely thin, going after different projects, things that you don't know about. Then you're gonna have to you know form LLCs on top of LLCs to protect yourself, and then you have like the tax. It's just a t- it's just almost a time waste for things that you don't know that much about. So, thing that I'm uh, I've recently got realigned with, and that I want to share with you guys. Um, is that I'm, I'm going I'm going back to the focus, and I've talked about this a couple times, but it's incredibly important. That art right there is just, I think it's got to go. Honestly, I think it's got to go. Anyway, um, the focus. So go all in, um, but really, 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 I mean, it's difficult. There's a lot of cool things out there. People are doing cool things. There's interesting things, but um, even Gary Vaynerchuk says, you know, go like two, three years, just go all in. And that's, that's what I'm doing. So hope you guys do the same. Don't get distracted. And by the way, even at, a, even at a smaller scale, it's like I even hear people who are in jobs that they like, they're fine jobs, whatever, they don't like love it, but they're just like want to make a move, you know, and I feel like that's almost a cop out a little bit because it's like you're just moving because you're, you're bored, whereas, you know, if you just grind through and just kind of uh, – no one's gonna love it, right? Feel uncomfortable for a little bit. Don't 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 stay if you hate it, obviously. But if you're just like kind of bored, or I mean boredom, I get bored easily. But don't just leave just to leave. Okay, leave if you have a plan. Um, 
and do something different if you have a plan. But don't just leave because you you want to give up or you want you know just something new. But not you're not necessarily you don't hate your if you hate it fucking leave absolutely leave. And I would say leave school too. Leave school even if you don't hate it. School sucks. Um, so anyway, that was a little bit of a ramble, but. I think uh, it's really important to uh, to stay focused. There's a ton of distractions out there. There's a ton of things to do. There's a lot of cool stuff. Um, but if you keep your eye on the prize, I think we can do things in this lifetime that we might have thought were, were unachievable. And, uh, and that's what I'm going after. So hope you guys kill it. Bye.